So every now and then I get stuck for inspiration and I sort of walk around the studio in circles and nothing really lights me up. So what I did was I threw a canvas on the floor and threw paint all over it um, and just to see where that paint went and see if a painting appeared from it. Um, there's a little bit more to it than that of course, I sort of prepped the surface. So what I did was I put a couple of coats of impasto gel and really laid them off very gently with the brush and then a couple of coats of universal medium over the top and that settled down into all of the little weave and all of the brush strokes and everything and flattened it off beautifully. And then once that's done, threw all my colour in and um, let it all swirl around. But anyway, I'm getting ahead of myself. So this was a piece that I'd done and I'm going to reproduce the same exercise now. So I've, I've thrown all this colour around here and to be honest I'm not 100% sure what I'm going to do with it yet. I'm just sort of sitting here looking at it and I can see if I turn it one way I can put some really soft silhouettes of trees and things in the background and then come forward and then maybe in the foreground you know like a, a, some stumps and things like that. I can make a bushfire. I could probably put the surface of the water here and put a breaking wave or possibly even silhouettes of some coconut trees as it recedes off into the dark. The really sort of tropical colours and things like that. So I'm still not 100% sure what I'm going to do. Um, it'll take a little while for this to dry, a couple of hours, um, and then I'll make a decision because it'll all change as it's drying. It's funny, it looks sort of really strong here and 
sort of weaker here and all that sort of thing, but as it dries, all the, everything changes. So I'll make a decision afterwards. But what happened, I went from being a bit bored and not knowing what to paint to now sitting there, I can't wait for this to dry so that I can paint stuff on it. <laughs> so it's a really fun way of sort of re-inspiring yourself. And even if a painting doesn't come out of it, that's, it's fun to do. <laughs> so I did that swirly thing with this and ended up chucking a, a wave over the top of it. It might not end up going on the studio wall or sorry, the gallery, in the gallery space or anything, but you know, it's fun just to play anyway. So don't be afraid to just chuck some paint at your canvas and see what emerges. At least you'll have had some fun making mess. <laughs>